out of the entire series, people caring for the people. one game that I don't Compassion. like has the best That's DLC. That's the foundation Gotham was built on. And I have proudly built Goth Corp on that same foundation. That's why we're called the People Company. Thank you so much. Please. Mr. No. Boyle seems to be after your title as Gotham's biggest philanthropic industrialist. Gotham needs more people like him. Bruce! Hey. <laughs> I am blown away by your support. It's well deserved. You're going to change the world, Ferris. Hey, we'll change it together, right? Pardon me, Mr. Boyle. The press is waiting. Well, this way, please. I'd say the future is looking very, very bright for Gotham. Now, it's almost midnight, and you all know what that means. Let's get this New Year's Eve party going with the... Whew. Forget to pay your heating bill, Bruce. <laughs> I absolutely love the brutality of this version of uh, Victor. Hold it right there! Yeah, got him! The butler's gone crazy! Are you cowards afraid of an old man? Uh, Just take it easy! <laughs> Hope that face wasn't worth something. We seriously doing this? Where do you keep your money? I was gonna go for a uh it's done. Can't do that. Glad these guys are a little bit easier. Are you okay? I've been through worse. These are penguins, men. What do they want with Ferris? I'm not sure. They're being led by someone in a mechanized suit. I need to find Ferris before they do. Well, you're no use to us dressed like that. You need to put on your other suit. The closest I can't wait to, to get my other suit. There's Bruce. He'll help us. Bruce. Bruce, do you have a minute? Someone said an iceberg just appeared, uh, exploded in the ballroom. I need details. What happened? Who do you think- Where's Ferris? He never made it to the interview. Wait, you're not going out there alone, are you? Stay with Alfred. He'll keep you safe. It was literally just we on hallway. Perhaps you should look for that uh, item in the wine cellar. Right. What the fuck happened to Ferris? Those men are armed. I'm going to have to take them down quietly if I don't want to get shot. I don't have detective mode. <laughs> Let's do a combat tag down here. They both don't turn around. Can't go under the parade for some reason. Saw somebody over here. Can I crouch? Excuse me? As Bruce, I'm just not allowed to access certain areas. Even though he's literally just Batman. Oh. 
working with this Mr. Freeze. Why do you think? Did you see that ice wave? You mean Freeze, Force? Hell no. We help Freeze get boiled and he gets us more of those ice spray things. Five. Come out of that cave more than once a week, you'd know that the bat cave entrance is in the wine cellar's tasting room. Look for the statue. I kind of got that while uh, when I was being railroaded in here. in that tunnel, sir. It's still suffering from the damage our visitor did on Christmas Eve. So, yep, this canonically does take place just after Christmas Eve night. I caught a glimpse of your mechanized man. These hooligans are calling him Mr. Freeze. You might consider donning your extreme environment suit. The XE suit? It's not ready for deployment. Oh dear. I hear helicopters. More penguin brutes. Do hurry. Time to prep the XE suit for deployment. I'll Ooh. need Alfred to put the finishing touches on it. Was no up there, just. I need to get back to the manor and find Ferris before Penguin's men do. What is down here then? Because I came up through that elevator. Penguin's men are in the north wing. I need to go back to the tunnel above the training area. This has to be something else. The only way back to the manor is on the elevator by the training area. A bit impatient there. I'm like, I'm like back speed gamer. Just slightly worse. Uh, before you ask, the formula we used for your glue grenades was unstable. What was left after Christmas Eve was degraded into dust. I won't have dust. glue grenades this time. Which possibly also means no pipes or water. What happened to the power? Sir, you must hurry. They're setting the manor ablaze. I've managed to get most of the guests into the east and south wings, but... Hey, it's the butler! Alfred. Alfred! Okay, this is... Weird. Like they know that Wayne Manor is also the back cave. Ah, uh, oh, it's tap. Come on, 
No, you don't. You have a gun? No, you don't. How are you still? How is this? And you don't have any children anymore. Still no signal from Alfred. Was that vent? Here you are. I'd better find another way into the library. Going up. Fuck me. Right, as long as that guy doesn't turn around, I will be fine. Be loud and proud. He's coming up this way. Just gonna set this guy off. Bye-bye. <laughs> I did not know the grab grabnel launcher could do that. Okay, they got Alfred. That's fun. You're going up there now. Back with the rest of the hostages, please. Thank you. Is the floor getting a bit hot? I wonder I have why to get they could possibly to safety, be. But the Wayne Crest is blocking the exit. Please, the crest is blocking the way out. You have to move it so we can escape. This way. Normally space. Why is it not space? Shh, quiet. They've got Ferris Boyle 
the next room. I... I think they're going to kill him. Hello. out of here I what the hell have you been? I heard about you I have no quarrel with you then you crashed the wrong party freeze what do you want with me I just require a moment of your time let me go help help me doing it looks like freeze isn't the only one with a cryogenic weapon this door is frozen shut I'll need to enter the ballroom through the balcony all right then Ooh, wait have not seen down here does not matter And he's gone. gone. One of Penguin's goons will know where that chopper's going. Excuse me? Okay, need to both gone front. Oh my god. Now they're both gone. My kind of eye. Uh, uh, they clearly should have hit. The guy's permanently stuck in ice, or not. I, I just killed him. Me. 
Where is he taking Ferris? I, I don't know. I promise. Do you have any idea how many of your friends I sent to the hospital on Christmas Eve? Look, one of Penguin's dealers. He stole out the weapons Freeze gave us. He must know. We were supposed to meet up in South Gotham. You can meet up in the emergency room instead. South Gotham. I hope Penguin's dealer can tell you what this Mr. Freeze has done with our friend. Targeting someone like Ferris Boyle. It's sickening. I know you'll bring him to justice, sir. I'll see this one wheeled into Blackgate on a gurney. Eight two dispatch. Hey, so Confirming that code that? three. Looks like these anarchy fanatics are taking advantage of the lack of police presence down here. Roger eight two. Continue right. to monitor. Backup. <laughs> no chance of that. I should deal with those anarchy followers, but first I need to. It seem. Arkham City is blocked off. Track down Penguin's dealer and find out where Freeze has taken Ferris. Right into Gakko. Oh. You come on it. Should think, boss. Take those two down. Save the hostage. Penguin going. Armed. How'd you do that? Where are they taking Ferris? Mr. Boyle? They, uh, they're heading to the propellant research wing. These guys have been raiding the whole facility. Do you have the codes to this security door? No, I don't have clearance. But my boss does. A bunch of them took him to the organics lab, through the lobby. I'll make sure they don't hurt your boss. Get yourself to safety. Got a sniper already, hostage. I, I'm cooperating. I'm cooperating. I know, I know, but we all got jobs. But there's uh, a few goggles as well. There's a jammer. Where are you coming from? You believe me? You know what? I do believe you. But to be honest, I just really love my job. Try and take one down, I have to take the other one down at the same time. Can I land on here? Oh, because you're fucking arm. Um. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. Jesus Christ, have a... Stop having a panic attack. <laughs> Is this free for the price of one? Mm -hmm.
What the? Oh, no. I was so close. Oh, it's a real shame you're dead. You're actually worth more alive. <laughs> I can pull you up here, right? Yes. And there's the loss of blood. Holy crap! How do you oh, do sorry, rush of blood to the head. Okay, so now we just have one, two, seven. Oh, you too. All snipers are gone. You okay? Come on, man, answer me. This is it, man. You wanna go up? I think you do. Could happen. That's not on you. It's not safe to go along. Oh, did he? He broke the guy out. Shame. Do a tight rope takedown. Oh, but I have to land first. Uh oh. You guys see anything? I lost it. You let him get away. I told oh. you not to do that. If we stay still, we're dead. We gotta flush yes. him out. So you go first. What the came from over here? I'm sure of it. Bye bye. See how many people I can hang on the same fucking gargoyle. <sighs> that rub means I can't anymore. Didn't go as planned, but it Holy worked. Holy crap! I saw you on GNN! You just saved my life! You have codes I need to access the propellant research wing. I do. Here. Take them. You're going to save Mr. Boyle, right? 
It's not safe inside Gothcorp. You need to get out of here. Don't worry. I won't be hanging around. And, uh, thanks, you know? Not just for me. For Gotham. Cool. Somehow, Edward has managed to escape yet again. Give me oh. Boyle, or I'll freeze this entire room. Oh, I know you won't. Boyle's got the code you need, and I ain't giving him up. Let's all get what he's giving you. What's behind this door is of no interest to you. I think Penguin should give him up, considering what he would do, what Freeze would do to him. chance to let him go. Threats are meaningless to a man who has lost everything. <laughs> What's Freeze after? Why does he need Boyle? Boyle's got codes he needs to access some kind of super weapon. And now you let him have it! That ice is the only thing saving you from getting the beating you deserve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, you ought to save our friend Mr. Boyle, yeah? But you'll never break through this ice. Gothcorp has a device. It's uh, uh, like a drill. A cryo drill. Tell me where it is. I had my men bring all our uh, acquisitions to the My Alibi nightclub. For safekeeping, of course. Then you better hope your men are still oh, in my you alibi. Oh, did it from, uh, from Payne, then. If I want to break through this barrier of ice, I better get to the My Alibi nightclub before Penguin's men decide to relocate. XC suit drop incoming, sir. All right, then. Ah, it's the classic drop part. Why is it? I oh, know it's on the roof. And now we have Borky Bat. The thermal gloves should help you deal with most ice you encounter, sir. And the suit will provide protection from cold and cryo vapor. I just hope its bulk won't slow you down. The honeycomb structure insulates against extreme cold without increasing weight. It won't slow me down a bit. Okay then. Listen, we ain't going nowhere. Oh, it's loose lips. Tell me exactly where the money's stashed. I, I don't. Why are you picking on me? I'm not. You just you keep it here. You stole a cryogenic here. drill from Goth Corp. Well, Where yeah. Where'd I go? But it ain't here. Penguin said to sell off the parts. It's in pieces. Where are they? I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Just don't drop me off a roof, okay? Maybe next time. I'll need to evacuate this lab of cryo vapor before the lockdown protocol on this door is disengaged. God's sake. Some help. There's a few people on the ground now. Quick play around! Hey, 
Anybody hurt? What the? Where the hell are you? I ain't got time for this. Here I'm just trying to glare at the fucking things. Certainly weird. Okay, so there's, there's more going on here than a simple expedition. accident. This security guard's skin has the same okay. coloration as me. I should set up a crime expedition. scene. So we've got a golf course. Data cup, analysis indicates that he died from heat stroke, but the control room doesn't show signs of overheating. This is some kind of crystallized chemical residue. Traces lead back into the lab. Oh, I'm gonna have to create something after this. I'm not allowed to break him out. That's fun. Trail ends here. I should okay. scan for more evidence. Thank God. Two men struggled. One of them ran out of the lab. That would be the dead security guard I found. Uh, somebody was panicking in this room. These palm prints are a match for Victor Freeze. He must have watched the security guard die. Is there some sort of like cryo? Freeze scavenged cure? what he needed from various prototypes to build himself a super cooled survival suit. Extreme pressure built up inside the tank when ice sealed these outtakes. It appears that this guard was frozen by the cryo vapors from the resulting explosion. Am I not allowed to riot? Fun. Excuse me? I didn't even cancel that. The evidence suggests the guard was frozen before the tank ruptured, perhaps by Freeze's cryo cannon. These DNA traces are a match for Victor Freeze. Spatter analysis suggests a blunt impact. Someone assaulted Freeze with a weapon. 
the cannon was knocked over and fired. When the tank exploded, it released a plume of cryochemicals. The plume enveloped right. Freeze and the guard, but the shockwave knocked the assailant clear. I need to find that weapon. It may have evidence I can use to identify the assailant. Right, so those cryochemicals created Freeze. Uh, the guard... tried to run out. But without Cryotech to uh, actually help him, he starts dying. Well, isn't that a predicament? To now follow, I, f I believe, is Ferris. Ah, that's a gun. Oh, what used to be the gun. DNA analysis confirms the gun was used to bludgeon Victor Freeze, and fingerprint analysis shows Ferris Boyle. It was Ferris. And there's Nora. Something was wheeled through this fluid, possibly a gurney. The fluid must have frozen almost immediately for these tracks to have been preserved. is all piecing itself together and is Freeze a... was secretly doing research on Huntington's Korea. But this is a cryogenic weapons lab. The test subject was Nora Freeze. Now I know what happened here. Boyle hired Victor to help advance the secret cryo weapons program within Gothcorp. In exchange, Boyle agreed to devote Gothcorp resources to finding a cure for Nora's Huntington's. But Boyle was more interested in how Victor had managed to put Nora into cryostasis. When Victor realized that Boyle had no intention of following through on their deal, he decided to do the Huntington's research himself. But Boyle didn't like that. The cryochemical cocktail altered Victor's metabolism, as well as the guards. Boyle escaped ahead of the plume and had the lab quarantined. Victor survived, but he knew that leaving the supercooled lab would kill him. So he built himself a suit and utilized an organic supercoolant to keep his core temperature sub-zero. All this violence. He's just trying to save his dying wife. The super coolant Victor uses in his suit oh, is the, the same drill. fluid I need for the cryo drill. Victor, you have to let him go. I'm taking my wife. You can't stop me! I know the truth, and so will the police. Boyle will face judgment for his crimes. It, it was an accident! That was not an accident. That was entirely malicious. Nothing matters, do you understand? Nothing but my Nora! You've endangered lives all over this city. Nora would never have wanted this. No. 
What she wants is to live a long life in the warmth of the sun. Her hand in mine. But because of him, she'll only feel the icy touch of a man whose Thanks, emotions Blood run as cold as the blood in his veins. Glad to know they started working again. Sir, you need to find the control panels for those cryo generators and disable them. You should be helping me, Batman, not fighting me. Just gonna wait for him to come over here. Ah. He's escaped. Yes, well done, I have escaped. This is how the fat man rewards incompetence. This man should have been more careful. Be over that way. Come on, no way he got money. He's given away his position. I am. How did he escape? You can overload those cryogenerators using your thermal gloves. Look for the control panels. I'll do it in a second, Alfred. This is not your concern. It is between oil and me. It shouldn't be of any my concern, but then you uh, help burn down the manor. I am taking Nora. You cannot stop me. What are these cryogenerators? Up here? For you. I am not leaving without my wife. Do you hear me? Lady Knight. That was not meant to... 
feed my target. Actually, I do. <laughs> Slow, <laughs> decrepit, and depressing. There is no need for this, Batman. It was a relief that she finally passed away. Okay, just leave the cryo generator alone then. Continue to leave it alone. Nope, don't want to do that. Yes, no shit, Sherlock. Okay, hold away. That didn't get it. I'm not going to stop you from taking Nora. Focus, Daniel. I'll box you in, Batman. This is over. meant to be an attack on you. It's meant to distract you. There is no need for this, Batman. There we go. 
Got four of these morons. No, no, no. Even escape from this room. If this is how you want it to be, so be it. What do you see? Where are you? Where are you? Damn it! Damn it! How'd you lose them? I don't know. How the hell did he just disappear? Well, ain't that funny? A real kick in the head. I'm not leaving without my wife. Do you hear me? Do it. <laughs> I won't allow my wife to be subjected to any more tests. Do you understand? Hoping at least to actually distract him. I hate that they're not. Do you have any idea what Coyle was doing to her? If this is how you want it to be, so be it. And he's not gonna turn around. Now into the actual fight itself. See how well you do when the air freezes in your lungs. We fear you do not come between the masses. That 
room is filled with ice formations, Master Bruce. I suggest you use them to your advantage. You have forced me to do this. And that's three of them down. Two of them. Three of them down. Right, I don't think there's as many opportunities to actively take him down as there is in C. I think it is just like these types of takedowns. And then back up. My patience wears thin. Do not allow him to escape again. Focus, damn you. I know you're up there. How the hell did you know I was up there? Can't do that. How did he escape? You have to stop me and come out of the shadows. Where are you? Your destiny. You are resourceful, I'll give you that. I have escaped quite a few times now. That's three, four. Oh, sorry, that's all three of them down. You still doing that? Just like a really nerfed version of the original fight. We escaped. We made a deal. Now get in here and find the Batman. Have you lost your resolve? Mine remains as strong as ever. Well, Batman, I'm out and do what you came to do. Uh oh. What the hell happened?
founded the estate. He's right there. That was not meant to happen. Do not test my patience. You have forced me to do this. Can I do an eight? No. Well, Batman, come out and do what you came to do. Sarah will not stop me with these toys, Batman. Didn't mean to do that. You'll mark your resolve. I remain as strong as ever. Alright, let's try this again. Can I do that takedown? No, I can't. Can I do it here? Yes, I can. Do a hanging? No. Nope. I think he stopped uh, getting the goons back in because they've not been doing much. Was it though? I'll box you in, Batman. You have forced me to do this. Seriously, I have Batman. no idea how I'm stopping him like this. Do what you came to do. You want to stop me? Uh oh. Cool. Being given a use of health. I need to somehow if I can get, up get there. underneath him. I can take him from below. And the back. 
One last takedown. Going to the stream. Thanks for doing the heavy lifting. Or at least first off the stream. But you shouldn't have stuck your nose in my business. And here I thought I was going to have a problem explaining what happened in your lab. I mean, the police are never going to look at me after what you did. And with this bat freak dead, there won't be anyone left to say otherwise. Cryogenic containment failing. Laura. And that just leaves you. Please, you can save her. You just have to bypass the cryo no. no. Victor, she dies. Oh, and I'll keep you alive long enough to see her go. No. Oh. Oh. Asshole. Cryogenic <laughs> One last play. Barris probably goes down. Take a seat, humanitarian. I'm sorry, Victor. I can't give you peace, but I can give you justice. Gotham at this hour where protest has turned to celebration. Under extreme pressure from Gotham's citizens, Mayor Hill has just announced his resignation. While Hill has not ruled out a possible run for re-election in the new year, his resignation means that Peter Grogan will likely not be the next police commissioner of Gotham. Speculation has already begun about who the new mayor will appoint as commissioner, with many pundits naming GCPD Captain James Gordon as the frontrunner. And now to South Gotham, where Vicki Vale brings us this live report. Thanks, Janine. I'm standing at the corporate headquarters of Goth Corp, where Captain Gordon has confirmed that Goth Corp CEO Ferris Boyle has been taken into police custody. Police report that Mr. Boyle stands accused of manslaughter, extortion, and attempted murder. Shocking accusations given that just earlier tonight, he accepted the Wayne Foundation's award for Humanitarian of the Year. Also in custody is the notoriously elusive underworld crime boss Oswald Cobblepot, better known as the Penguin as well as a Gothcorp cryogenicist, Victor Freeze. Mr. Freeze is being held under heavy guard at Gotham General, receiving treatment for an undisclosed medical condition. Quincy Sharp has suggested that Mr. Freeze is yet another example of the type of criminal that needs the specialized care that only Arkham Asylum can provide. Police credit these arrests to solid police work, but this reporter suspects the vigilante known as the Batman had more than a small role to play. On a personal note, I owe Batman a debt of gratitude for rescuing me from almost certain death earlier this evening. So, thank you, Batman. For all of us. Back to you, Janine. Thanks, Vicky. The Batman continues to be one of the top stories this holiday season. So as we here at GNN wish you all a happy and safe New Year's Eve, we'll leave you with just a few of the comments you've made about Gotham's caped crusader. I was surrounded. Next thing you know, bam, boom, kapow! The bastards are all on the ground, KO'd. I didn't even see him coming. Oh, it was all a blur. He just whooshed in out of nowhere. Listen, I'm a cop. I can't condone what he does. But I can be grateful he's doing it. Oh, he's real, all right. I got the bruises to prove it. He's real, he's ruthless, and there ain't nothing in the world that's gonna stop him.